Yeah, I mean, yeah, he's playing Pichu, and that's it's Pichu, bro. <laughs> yeah, I, I like Pichu. I think Pichu's kind of cool. Even though a lot of people would be like, what's wrong with you, Dex? Why do you like Pichu? He's a dude. He's a dude. All right, so we're moving right into it. So we got Elegant and Nico. Yeah, in winner's finals here. Need, okay, okay. Uh, you know, we saw this on MSM. These guys fought twice on MSM. Uh, three, Ele yeah. Yeah, Elegant had a pretty clean 3-0, I think, on the first time. And then during grand finals, Nico just kind of ran away with it. I, th I think it was like 6-0 or 6-1. It was rough. Yeah, it was pretty rough. No, he just like had a 5-0 just come back after the first game that Elegant took. So it was pretty, pretty rough. But, I mean, if anything, Elegant has shown that he can, he can do pretty well, you yeah. know? Um, as I was talking about this matchup earlier, I thought um, Luigi has a lot more get off me, or not even more, but just better, more potent get off me options like forward air and air. Um, and the way that I see Shulk is that he has wonderful range, but I actually really respect the way he's been designed because because he has such crazy range, when somebody goes in on him, of course he doesn't really have any great get off me options. They're, they all have crazy startup. So I think the best get off me option, like immediately, would probably be either his nair or a jab. Um, but yeah, I think the second that Luigi gets in is where Shulk starts to lose. Yeah, if you're gonna press Shulk before he gets out of those hitboxes, because it does have a bit of startup, that's really when you want to be able to get through. Because once it comes out, you just can't actually really do anything about it. Mm, yeah. All right, right now. Oh, missing that down. So yeah, that that add that adds some conclusion to it. <laughs> okay, I thought he died. I really thought he died there. Wow, man. Elegant will always go deep. That was a, such a smart up air. Because of the fact that his up air kind of sends up at an arc, it was such a good idea, but unfortunately not going to kill just yet. Mm. Now, I'm not entirely sure, but I, I was fighting some Luigi a little earlier, and does his up air, like if you hit like with the reverse hit of it, does it send you like in that Ganondorf arc where it's like if I hit you from the back, it'll send you all the way like horizontally? It kind of it kind of does, honestly. Mm. It's weird. Luigi's a kooky character. He's super kooky. Yeah, I see that down B is still pretty good. Well, is you know, not in terms of recovery, but it's still pretty good when it comes uh, to Yeah, it. it's invincible at the start for, well, you know what, why not? One frame, like, <laughs> frame one. Like, why? Who knows? Yeah, you know what, honestly, no good reason. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I, I think the game is actually quite well balanced. I, more balanced than four, but this game has a better engine, I think, uh, than four does. So... Who knows? Who knows how the developers actually like view this game? Because are are patches where they finish their characters, or in some other world would they have been completely happy with the with the characters that they have now and like how they finish them? Honestly, that's a that's such an interesting question. It's, it's one of those things where the developers like, you know what? Let's keep some secrets. But speaking of secrets, look at this lead that Nico has. He's not letting Elegant get in at all. And as I say, that gets opened up. You know what? My bad. My bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Joker, telegraphing who he's going to be playing in the coming months. Nice, wow, Nair into to dash attack. Uh, the, oh, no, 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 he's still able to make it back thanks to the dial. God, that dial, it, it doesn't look very intimidating, does it? But it's actually one of the best things that Shulk got. Yeah. Being able to actually recover reliably, who would have thought? Yeah. Oh, okay, not quite, not quite. Okay, both wishing, whiffing their attacks here. Uh, down throw going for the NATO, but yeah, shield, shield art. Yeah, you're not, you're not killing me. I don't know who you think you are. Easy money. Right now, Nico's looking like he's ready for a two stock. Uh, okay, I was gonna say like it didn't seem like there was an immediate whiff punish, but he was able to get a back air and sent him right off, and then got another back air to close that game out. Yeah, clean two stock, 120 percent. Okay, okay. And Nico looking like he's still trying to keep up this momentum against Elegant from MSM. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Imagine keeping your momentum for that long. How do I move this? I just want to move this like towards me. I have no idea. These these chairs have too many controls. Yeah, seriously. And this one's seen its use. Look at this. <laughs> I have I have one. One hand rest or arm rest, and the other one just got torn off. It's gone, bro. Oh yeah, man. If I could, if I could only like channel my frustrations into my main, I would rip this other one off, <laughs> no problem. Oh boy. 
keeping with Luigi. Uh, going to Battlefield, I'm not sure what I think about this pick. I'm not, I don't know why, but I feel like Elegant had his reason. I feel, not that I feel, but the reason probably being he wants to live a little bit longer against against Nico. So I think uh, two things. Uh, he likes landing. Uh, he This helps him land a bit better now that he has three different platforms. And this is probably four combo potential. Like, I think uh, the way that Luigi's down air or uh, down throw works is that it'll send him right onto a platform, uh, depending on this percentage. Mm -hmm. It'll put him into some uh, text chase situation. or It helps with uh, things like uh, down B as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if he's on that platform in tech chase, I'm pretty sure down B will just cover the whole platform. Oh, it's beautiful. And now, speaking of beautiful, oh my god, if it no, wasn't for shield, shield, that would have been a dead man. That was such a good idea from Elegant, but you know, shield mode gonna get him. Oh, barely killing him. Yeah, four throw. Oh. Come on, I'm not, it kind of looked like the VI, but that was probably just the bare percentages when it needed to kill. Mm -hmm. That was some good pressure, too. Not really letting go of the A button. Oh, I wonder if that was the fear that killed Nico. Yeah, he was so close to grabbing that ledge. I just, I don't think he had enough momentum to go into it. So Elgin with that good stock. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, if I don't think Nico was afraid, because like if he gets, if he gets hit by the down tilt, what, what else is gonna happen? Elgin still has to follow up and kill him. Mm -hmm. So you're probably right about that one. Ooh. Immediately even this back up. Buster mode is. A hell of a drug. Yeah, it really is, isn't it? Mm. Now, the thing about Luigi is that he doesn't really have any disjoints, and I think the best thing that he would have against that backslash, because Nico's been doing it pretty frequently. Oh, nice. Oh, spawning him off the top. Yeah, but it seems like uh, being able to use his, his grab, mm. Luigi's grab, that's probably like the best thing he can do against that backslash, or just go behind him. But uh, nah, this is probably just one of those matchups where he needs to stay on the on the edge and just ledge trap to the best of his ability. True. And we've even seen him ledge trap pretty decently. He is throwing out the plunger for the hitbox, but it's mostly like as a precautionary hit, like, hey, don't forget about this. Yeah, it's hard too. Especially the way that Elegance likes to use it. Oh, uh, forward tilt, quick it, swing. You know that forward tilt without art can do 16 damage. What? That's crazy. 16! What is this character? I don't know, man. That, that's so much damage. Why not, though? Yeah, why not? That was a really good landing from Nico too when he got back onto the stage. Uh, yeah, and he's got a little bit of work to do. He's kind of getting creamed. Mm, but you know, if anyone was gonna do it, it would be Nico. I like the idea with the parry. You want to see if you yeah, could. Quick F smash gonna even it up at one one. Yeah, he chopped into him. That that was actually pretty good. Yeah, frame advantage is such a big deal. Like, I don't really hear uh, the words frame advantage being tossed around a lot, but in other fighting games, I hear it all the time. Mm. It, it's basically, uh, how do I even put it? It's like arithmetic. Uh, okay, for example, I heard somebody saying that uh, parry wasn't that good. Parry, when you really employ it, is actually quite stupid. Mm. Because as far as I know, there are no two frame moves in this game. Uh, I think there's only three frame moves. So if I have a five frame move that you do to me and I parry it, it's you basically can't do anything about that because you only have two frames because you get three extra frames of advantage when you parry somebody. So yeah. the only yeah the only frame one and two moves are like Zero Suit's jab, Little Max jab, and like Lucas's jab. So it's just like jabs that are like that quick. Yeah. So basically, in essence, parry essentially breaks certain aspects of the game. Not to call it a broken thing, but sometimes when you get parried, you just can't do anything about it. It's kind of cool. I can't wait for people to start using it a lot more. Right now, we're looking pretty even. Ooh. That oh, was boy. such a good trace. Yeah, great read coming in there. He just stood there and waited to see what Nico was going to do. Any air dodge, I'm pretty sure he could have been able to just run up and read whatever he's going to do. You know, it's really messed up. I've seen Luigi shield poke with that up smash because it, it hits so high up. It's it's actually pretty disgusting. Ooh. It's pretty disgusting. You hang on that ledge for a hair of a second too long, and of course you're going to get that fair coming in from Nico. Yeah, Nico, uh, or at least Shulk has so many different ways of uh, two-framing you. Oh, missing that dash attack. This uh, this version of dash attack for Luigi is the safest that it's ever been. So it's I, I see Elegant using it quite often. Ooh, barely missing that. Okay. Yeah, he was he was kind of he was kind of close to Nico when he threw out that fireball. Now look at what's happening. And Elegant Elegant's really good at throwing the fireball when he's off stage, just like that, and he gets a lot of damage off of that. And it stops them, or at least it hinders their ledge trap. 
Hmm. And scouting out that roll with the back air. Nice. Ooh, yeah, that was a no tech zone situation. Ooh, the shield, uh, that might have been a little oh, preemptive. Yeah, it seemed like it, and already burning it off, so he's going to have to stall for a little bit so he doesn't have to. So he has the I don't want to die button, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's exactly what that is. Or the you can't juggle me from 0 to 70 button. Oh, yeah, but there we go, that plunger going in. Yeah, reading that air dodge with the down tilt is not going to hit just yet. I'm shocked at the last five seconds of this game. It looks like, like Nico just like kind of missed input of what he wanted to do and kind of plummeted to his death. Yeah, there's that 0 to 70 can't juggle me button. Okay, is that Nair? That Nair is so good, too. I think everybody knows that by, the, by this point. True. Yeah, him, Yoshi, and Mario is just disgusting. Dr. Mario's too. Uh, okay. Wow. I, I really thought Nico was going to have that with that fair, but, you know, oh. Luigi's not getting a little too strong there. I don't know if he has a jump. He does. Just messing with my mind. Oh. Why did that even hit? Dude. Dude. <laughs> what, bad, bad. what a great backer. Or great down air. It hits so far below the ledge and just stage biking him. I wouldn't have expected that to stage spike me either, or even hit me. Yeah, man, that was pretty, pretty disgusting. And you know, the funny thing is, like, I don't really know what Nico would have done. I don't know how safe that is. Like, I, how well can you land with down air? Because I don't know. Because if he were to miss that, Luigi could have probably gotten like a get-up attack or something. I don't know what Nico. I, I, I feel like it's pretty non-committal because even so, he could have like drifted away. And if he went for the get-up attack, that might have been, that would have been the most button she would have gotten anyways. Yeah, probably. Hmm, I think Elegant has a secondary in Mario. I yeah. saw I saw him play Mario the other day. Yeah, he is picking up Mario now, but you know he's trying to run it with Luigi. I have I have absolute respect, you know, if if you're going to be cuz I really like Footsie's characters and I definitely consider Luigi to be a Footsie's character. Mm, look at this. Oh, missing that forward air. Uh, yeah, like you said that 3 frame nair get off and your combo's mine. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. Okay. I love the way that Elegant employs the fact that uh, Tornado has those iframes, so sometimes if he's in a sticky situation, he'll just throw it out. Wow, that wow. was so good. That didn't look like much, but being able to like the way that he Edge guarded Elegant. That was really smart. Or the way he edge guarded Nico. And, um, oh. Elegant with a pretty sizable lead right here. Going into shield, but you know what? I'm not going to stop. I'll have new combos for that. Yeah. And the way that I see Elegant using is, ooh, I think he swallowed that jump. No, we got his jump. Okay. Oh, and now he's going to be able to live. He's going to have to charge up this, uh, this side B. Unfortunately, that B is going to kill him. Yeah, he uh, Elegant got his jump robbed from him. We're going for that quick up B. Elegant maybe showing his hand a little too early right there. We Definitely. haven't seen him go for that up B out of shield just yet. And look, it netted him a good 58% for it. And pers uh, um, positional advantage, too. Oh, God. <laughs> I like how he just went from shield in like a second. That was some good reflex right there. He needed it for that one hit and back air. Mm. Probably caught Elegant on the DI too. That's gonna explode him at about 80%. Nico one stock away from moving on to grand finals. Mm. If there was one thing that I saw Elegant do on Monday, uh, he was kind of landing on Nico a little bit. It seems like he calmed that down. He's playing a bit more patient now. Oh. Tries to up B again. Uh, speaking of patience, he uh, zealously went for that up B. Yeah, it looks like Elegant's getting really uh. What's the word? Kind of hesitant. He wants that stock a lot. Great parry. or well, not great. He went for it. I don't think you can actually challenge that like that, but you smash our tornado. Mm. You're going to die. Mm -hmm. All right. We're at 85. 80 fizzle. Okay. Oh, the fireball. Okay. That was that was interesting. Expanding the hitbox or extending the hitbox a little bit. So now a good I, I like how he just went on the ledge to try to hold out the... This is Nico's to lose here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I can't believe we recovered there, but that's going to be re grab. Oh, no, it wasn't. I was yeah, Elegant kind of freaked out a little bit there. Yeah, 112%. He's going to he's gonna really need to turn it up right here. Yeah. But he's getting hit so much. And now he's in Smash Art. Needs to to close out the game. All right. I, I, this is the most defensive play I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Elegant's trying so hard. He knows he, he just needs one hit, and he'll be able to like get a bit of advantage. But Good there we go. There's a the grab, but we're already in the shield. shield. You know, that's okay, though. That's a good way of getting it out of the way. Yeah, you. I don't know what the cooldown on shield is. It's probably something like 20 seconds, so he has a bit of time to actually just get honest-to-god damage. Mm -hmm. So he's trying. He's 
he, he's thinking so far ahead. He's playing chess in his head. Hmm. I mean, it's working out. It's working. But F tilt gonna explode him off the side. Elegant dropping that three one to Nico. Uh, so 25 seconds. See, chat chat is cool sometimes. I yeah. Chat I, is cool sometimes. I need to go on Twitter and find out the cooldown for all of them because I want to know, but I have no clue. Yeah. Honestly.